This week, Ian continues clearing the garden. Our friend Francis comes to repair the chateau roofing, and we discover some unexpected issues around the domain. <laughs> Trist. Mm. <laughs> This is our beauty. Just gonna do a quick test to make sure everything works. And then this cherry picker will be ours for the next few days. No, no, c'est le mien qui est le meilleur fromager de Paris. Tu sais même pas où il est. Attends, mais je sais. Moi, je me souviens, j'ai pris la route. So we're having a little argument. I think that my cheese guy is the best cheese guy in Paris. He's saying that his cheese guy is the best cheese guy in Paris. But he also was confused. He thought that my cheese guy was his cheese guy, and now he's saying something different. C'est le meilleur, le meilleur. Laurent Dubois. Laurent Dubois. Ouais. Mmh. Pas très loin de chez, euh, chez, chez Joe. Chez Joe. Affineur propose Propine. une palette de fromage raffiné provenant de différents. C'est pas un fromager. C'est un artiste. Oui, bah le mieux aussi, tu vois. Ben, <rire> ça, se, ça se trouve que c'est euh, le même, euh, il a deux ans. Euh, <rire> mais et je crois qu'il a plusieurs fromagers, effectivement. C'est pas c'est pas qu'un fromager, c'est un affineur. C'est-à-dire mmh. qu'il prépare ses fromages. Mmh. C'est pas juste euh, je traite la vache, j'ai du lait. Et, non, il va il va juste. Parce que tu as des fromagers qui traitent la vache dans le magasin. Et non, <rire> pas dans le magasin, le magasin. Et, et, non, non. Non, non, mais c'est le meilleur, c'est un des meilleurs. Tu verras. Oui. Tu verras. Ok. Vas-y. Ok, j'y vais. Non, pas tout de suite. Pas tout de suite, on a du travail là quand même. Il y a une petite cherry picker. Une cherry picker, oui, elle mousse. Oh, elle mousse et elle bounce. Oh, ok. So Francis just arrived with the cherry picker and he already has gotten to work on the hole in the pigeon tower roof and we have to go get a rake for him to get rid of all the moss on the roof. You say hello to Francis? You wave your hello. Hello. <laughs> Just finished cleaning off this tiny staircase roof thing for the dove house and then notice that this the kind of a problem
So now I am preparing the mousse solution, and this is what we'll use to clean off the roofs after we scrape them to prevent future moss growth. Now, moss in French is actually pronounced mousse, so don't get confused because we're gonna use the mousse to clean the mousse. And that's not all, because in French, they also have mousse-like shaving cream and then chocolate mousse. But don't worry because the animal mousse is pronounced élan. So, en français, je vais préparer le mousse pour les mousses et après je vais manger le mousse. Look out, élan. I'm 12. Ready? Yes. Super. Bon, alors. Euh, alors, tous les petits bois qui tiennent les tuiles, les litos, sont complètement dégradés. Tous. Tous. Tout autour Tout autour. Tout autour et à plusieurs petites fuites euh, par an. C'est ça mon cadeau de Noël Ah bah, c'est un, un, cha... un petit chapeau de Noël. <rire> un petit... D'ailleurs, je t'ai recouvert le petit chapeau en haut. Regarde. Oui. Oh, ah, voilà. Tu vois, ah, franchement, c'est beau en plus. Ah, bah, c'est -ce du plomb. C'est du plomb. Du plomb. Oui. Ah. Alors, okay. là, tu vois le petit trou. Oui. Donc, ça, c'est. Et ça, là... c'était pas pour errer Non, il n'y a pas d'aération. Euh, non, non. Là, okay. c'est un endroit où, euh, pour installer les tuiles, euh, il faut que je casse tout le haut, la, la maçonnerie. Ouais. Donc, c'est pas facile. Là, tu vois. Zoom, zoom sur la tête. <laughs> Triste. Mm. <laughs> uh. So the main beam coming down from the top is totally rotten out and it's rotting onto all the little beams going across. So yeah. All of these little guys should be rectangles and they're all falling apart. And so they're not holding the tiles up anymore, which basically means that... Yes. <laughs> yes, okay. <No. laughs> that was me trying to put a little bit of my frustration into the wood. It totally didn't take any of it. <laughs> oh my God, look at this. It's totally... Look, I can just dig my nail right into it. It's totally rotten out. Ça c'est de la. C'est pas une bête, ça? Non, ça, ça c'est un pourrissement. Là, oui, là effectivement, il y a la bête qui a, qui a mangé. Non, mais c'est dû à l'humidité du, du bois. Euh, vu que le bois est humide, euh, ben, les, les, les mangeurs de bois viennent, viennent, viennent finir le travail. Là, c'est ce qu'on appelle de la bricole. Mm -hmm. Donc on a, on a réparé quelques petits trous. Euh, mais il y en a beaucoup. Et euh, bon, beaucoup de, trop. Beaucoup trop. Ok. Beaucoup trop. Alors, c'est euh, pas la peine de continuer. C'est pas la peine de continuer. On a enlevé la mousse sur le toit. Là, c'est une grosse partie tarte. Et euh, du coup, bah, je pense qu'il faut qu'on passe ailleurs. Oui. Parce que le château, c'est quand même plus important. Ouais. Bon, oui. Le château. Okay. Oui. On y va. On y va. <rire> <rire> Allez. <rire> Alors, euh, question importante. Oui, question ouais. importante. Alors, oh, okay. oui, non. Oh, les Français, ils mangent tout. Oui, 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 oui. Euh, quand même pas. Hein? Hein? Je peux pas. Hein? Um. Je commence pas. Hein? Non, non, Attends, non. les escargots, les grenouilles, bah... toutes sortes de fromages. Ah oui, des fromages, effectivement, c'est mon péché mignon, effectivement, oui. Mais on aime les fromages. On aime les fromages. Et des bons vins aussi. Ah bah oui, oui. Ça, va, ça va de soi. Euh... Avec modération. Ça c'est pour le... Toujours modération, ah, ah, voilà. oui. <rire> ou euh, si on a l'autorisation de, de le faire en zinc ou... Euh... Mais on pourra peut-être le faire en verre, non En verre Oui. En Genre verre. de faire... Euh... Oui, pour qu'on puisse regarder les étoiles. Ah oui Et dis-moi, euh, au niveau des autorisations, tu as, as le droit de poser... De de poser une toiture différente que celle-ci bah, Il faut que je demande. Mm. Il faut que je monte une dossier, que je l'envoie à la mairie, mm. qu'ils me disent 
réponse oui. Ou non, ou non, ou oui. cer certainement non d'ailleurs. Écoute, non, Francis, on, essaie on va essayer d'être positif. positif. Ah, ah, on va y aller. Et, Et si jamais tu le fais, il faudra quand même élaguer l'arbre là-bas. Oui. Ok. Mm. Tout dans son temps. So today I want to take advantage of this surprisingly good weather and finish cleaning off this last portion that we have yet to get to. And what we've been doing is just coming out and cleaning off some of the brush that was left over from a few weeks back. And it's just an ongoing process. So hopefully when I'm finished, we'll have a nice view of these stairs, which are in much better shape than the ones on the other end. Uh, those ones, those are not going to stay. We have to replace those, but these ones are solid. My little time-lapse camera just decided to sleep on the job. Oh, it looks it looks good there anyway. I'm done. <laughs> little by little, it's coming together and it's looking better already. I think that this whole space is just gonna be, it's gonna be a place where a lot of people hang out. At least I sure hope so, because it's gonna be pretty amazing. I don't know about you, but I can totally imagine a big uh, flower pot like a big chateau style flower pot. We have two on the back side of the bridge, but that would be really cool like that. Or some sphinx, sphinxes, sphinx eye, sphinxies. Okay, so this is, this is interesting. I was just cleaning up all of my gear and heading back to the house. And then I heard water. We have water coming to the fountain. I mean, it'll take about a thousand years for it to fill at this rate, but where's this water coming from? I have no idea. What I do know is I really like the sound of flowing water here. I'm just gonna imagine a big geyser of a fountain in the middle. Someday. After a heavy rainstorm, we noticed some water leaking into the chateau roof. So we asked Francis to check it out while we still had the cherry picker.
After the big storm, I came to the chateau to check if any of the windows had blown open or if there were any new leaks. And unfortunately, when I walked in, there was a big puddle on the floor and I realized that it was coming from upstairs. So I came up here to the gray room and I noticed that there was another puddle on the floor and the walls were totally drenched and the, the paint was discolored and it was peeling a lot more than normal. And since I knew Francis was coming, I asked him to take a look and check out the roof. And he did find a pretty big hole on the roof, so he patched it up. If it is fixed, then we may actually have a head start for peeling this old paint off so we can repaint this room. You know, if we're painting it ourselves and we'll save a lot of money. Yeah, the economy is also definitely making materials a lot more expensive. So some of the quotes I got like six months ago have already doubled. This year we've actually had two clothing shoots. Mm -hmm. One was for, how do you say it, Rim? Rim? Rim Aradaki. Rim, Ar Rim Aradaki. The number one wedding dress sales place. Right. And then this other little clothing brand, you may have heard of it, it's Louis Vuitton, but... Um, Louis Vuitton. Yeah. They, <laughs> they did a photo shoot here this year, and they also did a uh, video shoot at the mm -hmm. Chateau. And I, this room wasn't featured in either of them, but I feel like if we did a really good job with repainting this room and with a beautiful view of the garden, mm -hmm. then we might get some photo shoots in here. Oh look, there's more waves. Yeah. That's actually I think really I nice. need to go to the ocean again. <laughs> we can go back to Enfleur. That was nice. Yeah. I don't know who painted this last, but look what they did. They painted like the bottom of the mirror gray, but the rest of it gold. They didn't even take off the tape on the top part of the mirror. And there's even drops of paint on the mirror. Oh yeah, I can totally see the moisture coming through. Yeah. I'm thinking maybe we could do something a little more modern. Not quite like zebra stripes, but uh... <laughs> that wasn't my first guess, maybe my second, but <laughs> good. I'm glad we're on the same page. No zebra stripes. No zebra stripes. <laughs>